All right, everybody, welcome back to another episode. And before I can tell you why I have shulker boxes and stuff prepared right here, we still have to take a look at the ocean monument, now fully drained and mostly without sand. So, right here. I kind of left the sand all around here. Also, if we just take a quick look somewhere down here, you can see this entire place is still not clear. So the entire space underneath and inside is still completely full with water, uh, which is why I just kind of, you know, left the sand on this level as it is with there are also a lot of these guys all around now, but other than that, this place is completely cleared out. All... oh. I hear them. Well, anyway. Yeah, there's still stuff going over... oh, poor guys. Well, anyway. Oh, I forgot some. Now it's completely free of sand up here. And also it looks very, very cool when you have shaders on. Uh, so let's go into these ones. There are ones where I really like the like glass and water texture, but the... Sand is just basically blinding white because it reflects the sun in a way and it's it makes it very difficult to look at. Anyway. Oh the sun is a little bit bright, but that's the, that's the whole point, right? No, but just seeing it with shaders. Come on. I please. Let me fly. There we go. Can I get out without a pro trouble? Yes, I can. Okay. And... Oh, okay. Just, just look at this. I think it looks so great with shaders and everything. Even though we cut it a little bit short and everything, it's was still a whole lot of work. And technically we're not even done since there's a whole lot more underneath and inside if we wanted to drain the entire thing. If. You know? Oh, you can see our place in the background. I like the water texture. Anyway, just take a look at this. It's also pretty cool from... Like, through the glass. Just looking at it like this. I I really enjoy this. I really enjoy it. But... I'll keep the shaders off for now because it just... Ever so slightly, sadly, makes apparently just everything lag a little. So we're gonna stay without them. This is still so weird. Anyway, we have this entire space now. It's not lit up or anything at all, except for where all the lanterns were already. But yeah, we can still figure out something we want to do with this. Maybe we actually leave the sand here or change it out to grass and do something with that. But that is not what we're doing right now. I'm just gonna... Can I do this? Probably not. So I'm not gonna test it out. Anyway, why I already put some stuff over here. Um, this is basically what's left of uh, the sand... Not of the sand, of the... I, I, this is basically what I had left without tearing out all the sand. Which is this and stuff that I already made into sandstone. Which means we are adding another building over here. 
and not just any building, but we need to do something about this in particular. Because right now, this is, this is how we get more villagers. And then we would have to transport them all the way up there. Up, up there, you can barely see the top of those buildings, like there, somewhere. I think that is part of the building. Anyway, we would have to get them all the way up there. And now there isn't even much space to put more villagers to begin with, because we already kind of extended all the way out to here. Meaning... I want to make a proper building where we have the villager just standing properly and uh, all of that. I need to put those in boats though and put them just slightly somewhere else. I hope I, I hope that works out. But I mean, nothing could ever go wrong. Where are my boats? There they are. Uh, also, yes, I'm using the elytra again because I just, I couldn't. We, we lost it through the bug and this isn't like, uh, I mean, yeah, it's just, we lost it through a bug and it's, I don't really want to go back there again because it would just take so much time. Oh, Alright, yeah. get in the boat. The boat! The other one. The other boat. Please. Okay. Get in. Get in the boat. There you go. Okay. Uh, I can push them without actually being in the boat, right? I cannot. Okay, so... I can move him somewhere else, but then I can't move those two idiots because they are sharing a boat. Oh, well. We still need the space over here, so I guess I'll just well, have to figure something out for them. But first, let's get rid of this guy. So what I've been thinking, right? It's going to be two floors, right? Or at least two floors. Where on the top floor we have all uh, the beds where they can breed and stuff, right? And then the bottom floor... Uh, will be the actual trading part, right? Because I don't want to go through the bottom floor to get to the top floor where all the villagers are uh, and have to struggle with that every single time. Oh. That would just be very unfortunate or rather annoying, I guess. Uh, let's see, how far can I get you into these corners? Good enough for me. Good enough for me. That's number one out of the way. Now you two. You know what, actually? Ah, oh, damn it, I hit him. That wasn't what I ex wanted to do at all. Oh, please give me the boat. Thanks. Ah, you get over him that I hit him. Uh, let's do it like this. I need... I shouldn't have tore down the howl or that little thing in the first place. Now I'm just building it back up again. You know what? Let me get take this boat as well and then just... Okay, so I need to get them both into separate boats somehow. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Never mind then. I thought I had to do some kind of weird stuff. Okay, I'm almost killing my villagers with this. Oh no. Anyway, let's row you over into this little corner. And add you to this little place over here, right? And oh no 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 no! Please get in the boat. Get into that boat. Just please. 
Oh, okay. It's getting night. This isn't good. <laughs> I have terrible time management. Please spare me with this. Okay, done. Safe. Nothing bad could happen now. At least not to the villagers. Whew. Okay. Now we can clean this place up a little. I still wouldn't want any monsters to spawn over here. Or here. Or anywhere over here. Uh, this should probably be good enough, right? Yeah, this will be fine. Let me just move this slightly over here. Okay. So. We'll be following the same basic stuff we have going on with all the other houses. Which is technically not a lot, but maybe we can bring in some color with acacia or yeah, any of the other wood I have. And just go with that, meaning I'll probably have to pick up some wood. Oh, do I even have any? I mean, I have spruce. Well, I guess that's something I'll have to do at a later point in time. Okay. I did not expect that. Oh well. Uh, let's move you a little bit further. Towards the point where we actually want to build this, which is just... I guess right over here. Yeah. Let's just do that. There, 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 there. Perfect. Let's just turn all of you into this and... And get going. Yeah. Why not? Uh, this seems fine. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that's fine. We could go... Like this, just to be sure. Wait, I have a better idea how we can measure this better. Okay, if we have the bottom floor. Where's my stuff? We have the bottom floor, right? Uh, let's just say this is going to be the wall anyway. And the first villager would go here. Then he would stay here. This is his work workstation. And that is that. Or something similar to that. Then I want at least... If we do the same here, we have one, two, three, four, five spaces in between. Okay, so that is more than enough space. I'm good with that. Now, next question. How many of these do we want? So let's say we actually start here. Then there's a space for villager, wall, villager, wall, and so forth and so on. Um, one, two, three, four, five... Okay, how many professions were there again? A couple. Okay, good. If I want one of each, or at least two of each, then we double the couple thingy. And... I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, maybe. I... Actually, let's make 10 out of that. You are too close for comfort. Goodbye. Yeah, those are fine. I don't care for those, but... The creeper? No thanks. Oh, wrong. You. I probably have to fill... part of this up now. There. Right, and then this would be the next part. And then again, we go over, buy a few. Can I get this right? This looks about okay. Like here. Watch. Well, I'll find out. Straight line. Let's go. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, oh. Oh yeah, we have to remember that there's going to be an actual entrance to this place. 
So we might want to leave this open right here and put these up instead there and then we have a nice three wide entrance which is okay i guess it's fine it is fine it is okay uh let me get more of you what else did I use? How did I do all this stuff? I need to go back to check. Um, let's see here. Okay, just... I don't know. I just threw in blocks, I guess. That seems very appropriate. I just threw in some blocks. Hui. Okay. Uh, since I just threw in a couple blocks, just... Just do the same again, and uh, we might want to have the villagers basically be able to look, like, to see the outside, maybe. Where did the torch go? There it is. So, let me make some of these walls. I like these. I just like the way they look and all stuff. Maybe something like this. Hi. Who are you? Are you cheese or pumpkin? No, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's either cheese or pumpkin, but you know. They are shy and all that stuff. Um, some stairs, please. Maybe. Okay, actually, I need to, this to be one higher. So... Oh, maybe actually like this, so that we have a strong foundation and then get thinner. Because otherwise it just wouldn't make sense, right? You need a strong foundation and then you can go and have it be thinner. There. And then we can go switch between these two blocks. Uh, this one, that one, and that one. And then we'll figure out what we're going to do exactly with this part. I like it. I do like that idea. So I'll just... I'll just repeat that the entire way around. I, I think you get the way it's going by this little bit. Uh, I don't know if I want to have fence gates or actual glass in between here. We'll figure that out in just a second. But for now, I'll build this outer wall up and then we'll see where to go from there. So I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, I am back. I built this thing up and I tried the different things out I had in mind for this. And... I just prefer the glass, honestly. I don't know why, but this just doesn't do it for me. Maybe on the second floor we can incorporate that when the windows are smaller, but here I really just want these. I don't know why, I just like this more. It just fits better, I don't know. And it's also kind of funny that there's just a slight gap in between those things over there. Also, yeah, I put these in. Uh, because those will probably be the... No, not, those won't be the doors. Um, I just put those in for no real reason, if I'm being honest. But besides that, this is just filling in glass. No, but I kind of panicked because I was like, where is all our glass? I knew we had some left. I didn't use all of it on the monument. And then I was like, where is it? And then I remembered that we were trading glass for emeralds uh, with the villagers up there. And that I had the specific shulker box up there full of glass. And I was like, I'm out of glass. I have no glass. And then I found it. 
And yeah. I don't know. I just slightly panic, but that's fine. Also, we won't be able to get out like this, so let's just uh, put those away for the time being. Anyway, this is the base floor, and since all the villagers will be in these little places over here and here. Also, yes, I know this and those, those aren't the same length. I don't care, that's supposed to be like that. Because over here, except instead of these things, we'll make the way up. So we can properly get up to the second floor. There is a reason behind this and it's not because I miscounted. Okay? I did not miscount, it was all planned. Yeah. Anyway. I need more... Sand, once again, because why would I ever have enough sand in a place that is just made out of sand? Uh, let's see. Here, here, here. Actually, we probably can. Uh, let me get some of those cut sandstone slabs. And... Do this. Oh, wrong one. So, here, here. Will that go too far? I think it might. Damn. Let's cut that back by one. So, one like this, like that, like this, like that, like this. Damn it, again. And yeah, no, again. So we have to go even further back and just make it flush to the wall. There, and then it should work out. Like this, there, here, there. And then this is just gonna get... Locked off. Here. And... There. Um... Yeah, and then we just kinda do stuff with it, right? Where is... All the stuff I need? Gimme more. One up here, one up there. Oh, I just placed that torch. There. Right, and then you can barely get in over here. Very, very barely. Mmm, that's... Uh... We can fix that. Easily, actually. We'll just go like this. Problem solved. There. Problem solved. That was so easy. I can't believe I did not think of that sooner. Um, here. I don't know. Actually, let's keep this open in case we want to have something lead down. Like this, and then we can still close this up. Uh, I don't know. And then put fences... Here, I guess. Uh, here, there, and some more. There we go. There, there. And produced one here. Uh, okay. Now, I guess we, okay, this is going to be the top floor. Do I want this to be polished from the bottom? I think so. Which means, just give me an entire stack, I'll probably need it. 
There we go. And let's just go up here. And just kind of... There we go. I'll build this up. Probably not very nice and tidy. I'll make sure that I have these chamber chambers ready and... Then we can take a look at what the bottom floor is going to look like when it's completed, but empty. Anyway, uh, I'll probably go sleep since I see a witch back there. And I don't want to have those kinds of mobs over at this place. So, yeah, I'll sleep, build this thing up, and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. So, I'll see you in a second, once again. Okay, guys, welcome back. And we aren't quite done yet. But I did get a little bit carried away while I was building. So... The second floor is somehow finished. I guess. So I said I would do the bottom part where we would have these little things. I put these in just in case so we can place whatever thing we want here. Have a village in there or maybe even close it up. Obviously, there will be doors soon, but not right now because, you know, I'm kind of low on wood. Anyway, we made a way up here and this is basically just extra secure. Technically, just these would be enough, but, you know, just to be sure. And then it's basically just, this is just the big room where we're going to put a lot of beds and then all the villagers. And... Uh, this is relatively easy. These are just stairs I put together and then that's, an, that's another stair and just stuff. Yeah, we can take a look at it from the outside as well. But basically it's just stairs, a wall fence and then a cut sandstone and another stair. But let's go outside and take a closer look at that from here. So, can I? There. Okay, so, you see these are the upside down kind of stairs that just kind of go together. The wall with the fence and then the cut sandstone with another wall. And then just rounding it all out with the chisel stone. And obviously the roof itself isn't quite there yet. We don't have any of these little things that kind of go out or any other detail which is something that we'll be doing now i also got another box full of sand because we were running kind of low and we do have more than enough sand i don't think i'll have to go farm for more sand anytime soon oh, please, I'm just, just... anyway while why i'm taking all this stuff up with me is this empty yes this is empty that's empty Okay, these are the two we need, and this is what we need. So, what I thought, instead of just going around with those little slabs we have, we're gonna make a uh, little bit more of an extra roof. So, one, two, three, four, one, two, and three, four, so we can get more stacks. And I thought, at least for this little bit, I'm gonna bring you guys along again, because I already built almost this entire thing completely off camera. Yeah, that's why we will be building this little bit together again. Which is gonna make this episode go on for very, very long, but I, why didn't I just make all of these? Anyway, so what we'll be doing here. Oh, ooh, I almost jumped off and they are still there. Also, I checked on these guys because I forgot to put torches inside and I was very worried that they might die or something. In one of them, there was a creeper in the boat, and it almost blew up the entire thing. I had a mini heart attack. But, oh, look at this. This is a cute angle. Let's take a screenshot. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. The reason for that, we can even see the outlines of this. One, two, three. Come on. Is this... Yeah, whatever. That's, that's gonna be fine. Uh, where is... That's the entrance, so here. 
another five. Let's jump back down again. There, five again. And oh. Now we should just connect these again. And then we basically make just a mini tower on the side of this. Because for one this oh come on please. This entire thing is completely not symmetrical to begin with. Um, so we might as well keep it going to just have stuff up here. You can't actually access this place. It's literally just for decoration, but you know. Did we use... Okay, we use... Okay, we used different slabs. We used polished and non-polished. Um, okay, I guess we'll have to figure that one out then. Uh, let's just take these then. And please tell me this all fits. Okay, that looked so weird out of the corner of my eye. I thought some kind of monstrosity spawned. But nope, it's just a creep and three turtles. Oh. Oh my, that, that was... Kind of scary. Okay. There. Let's continue. As if nothing ever happened. There we go. And there. Now. Um. Let's see here. Is this three by three? Yes, it is. Okay. That goes in here then, and then we do the same here. I uh, know this would be fine. Yeah, that's fine. We had just have one left over, but we'll use it again anyway. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, that sort of works. Um, let me just. We're gonna need those at some point again anyway, so let's just get some more to begin with. There, um, we still have some stairs. I guess I'll just go along like this. Honestly, sometimes I know exactly what I want builds to look like, and then there are times where I'm just like, I, I guess I'm gonna start placing blocks. I, I don't know if it's working out or not. It could be that this entire episode just basically gets scrapped and I just tear this entire building down and build something different could happen I uh, happened before where I was just like no I don't like this and I just kind of so how did you okay I need to light that those two spots up desperately thanks for standing still for a second um anyway We'll just work our way down from there, I guess. Um, yeah, let's use some more of you. Maybe just a few here and there. I don't know. And some more here. There. Oh, too short. And there. Um, I don't really know what to do with this stuff. Um, let's just finish that off with these. Uh, here and there. And then proper, probably something like this. Just go around here. Oh. Oop. There. And we're missing one, two, three, four. Okay. Well, I guess we're making six. I don't make the rules. I just had to do that. Oh. There we go. 
Um, oh, that's basically empty. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I hope two more stacks of sandstone should be enough. Um, let's make some walls. And... Yeah, why not? Why not? This entire build has nothing to do with symmetry anymore. Even though, no. Not 100% symmetry. There's still symmetry and this is just mirrored and generally I go for the same stuff. But that and that doesn't match up. But So not perfect symmetry, but good enough, I believe. Um, do I want... That would be way too big for a window. Um, so instead, I don't know, but if I do walls like this, well, I guess we're doing walls like that. It's fine. Or we go walls like this. Just on this part and do something like this here. So it's like a window, you know? We'll see how it looks. There. We can compare, actually. Let me just quickly go out. Yeah, these with the windows and these without the windows. So we go with windows. There. There. And I don't know why. I need to go inside anyway. Uh, let's do these first. I'll need way more than what I just did. Okay. Yeah, way more. Let's make another half of these. And just... Please, let me just place some blocks. I really just want to place the blocks, man. Don't take that away from me. And... More blocks, of course. Why am I not just making all of it and then I have more for the next build, which will happen? It's just a matter of time. Okay, we can close that up. We can take this and probably all of these as well. And... We really just kind of go up here and make some of these. There. Let's see how many we need. There, 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 there. Oh, not there. Come on. I'm too sh Oh my god, I'm really... I thought I had it this time. I thought I made it perfectly, but nope. Nope. Once more, I did not. Um, let's just place some torches down. Because I really don't want anything to spawn up here. And that's, that's it, right? Yeah. Oh. Let's just fly on over here. And there you go. There it is. I think it actually looks pretty good. I I I think it looks pretty good. Let's let's do the shader test. Let's see if it looks good with shaders. Shaders usually just make everything look better, so I can't see where this is going to go wrong unless it crashes my PC, which would be awkward, but <laughs> hey. Um There. Look at this. I, you can't make stuff worse with shaders. If we want to go extra, we can place some leaves around, like we did all the way over here and stuff. Um, like, just on top of that thing, just make a, like, basically a garden area up there, even though nobody can access it, it can still look kind of cool. Um, something similar uh, we have up there, just... I don't know, maybe we just place leaves. But for now, this is this is nice. 
Let's take a look at how this looks on the inside. Oh, look at this. I like shaders so much. Shaders make everything nicer. Uh, but I wouldn't want to play the whole time with shaders. Also, very quickly, I'm going to show the other shader that just makes the sand shine white, in a sense, uh, with the, the PSL. It's going to take a second. Uh, but... Yeah, everything is just blindingly white, which is, yeah, it's a lot. It's you can probably turn that down a little, um, but I haven't really gone into that too much. So it's just uh, something I don't really use right now. But anyway, why is the sun there now and it was there before? Anyway, yeah, that is our villager place. I'll move those villagers in upstairs and place some beds down and start it up. And I have to move those guys back there <coughs> over as well. But I'll do that definitely off camera. Because we have been going for a good 40 minutes. Yeah, yeah, just over 40 minutes. So... Yeah, that took a bit, but we have a fully functioning, very nice looking villager hall, which we can just expand when we go down into the basement. So, with that, I think we achieved quite a lot today, and uh, I actually very much like the way this hall turned out. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it as well, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!